Okay, now YouTube is implementing a new AI powered feature called super resolution that automatically increases the video resolution of lower quality content, making it sharper and clearer, especially on large screens. As you can see, this 10 year old video posted by Mr. Beast, when I go to the settings and tap on quality, I can go to the advanced settings where the video resolution shows up to 720p and right above that we have got this super resolution option which offers 1080p resolution. Viewers can choose between the upscaled version or the original quality. The feature uses AI to automatically create high resolution versions of the videos that were originally uploaded at standard definition or below 1080p quality. The primary goal here is to make older videos more watchable on large high resolution TV screens. Next, Google has launched a new theme packs application on Play Store specifically meant for Pixel devices offering one tap personalization options that include coordinated wallpapers, icons, sounds and more. This initiative moves beyond the existing Material U dynamic color system by providing curated bundled themes. This has already been launched and currently available to download on Play Store. As you can see on my Pixel phone I have downloaded the application but it is currently not functional. It is not showing up when I try to customize the home screen or the lock screen. Apparently, Google is supposed to be pushing another update which will make the themes option available when you try to customize the home screen or the lock screen. The core idea is simplicity. Users can apply a complete device makeover, changing multiple elements simultaneously with a single tap. While the app has appeared on the Play Store, the full functionality requires a corresponding system or server side update from Google, which is expected to be part Part of a forthcoming pixel feature drop, likely the November 2025 update. This move marks a significant step in Google's theming support for Pixel devices. Next, let's talk about a big upgrade to the Google Maps application. Google Maps is integrating features powered by Gemini to create a more intelligent experience. These features will be available both on Android and iOS. The features will include conversational navigation, users can manage their journey with voice commands, users can ask multi-step questions like is there a budget-friendly restaurant with vegan options along my route, something within a couple of miles and then follow up with what's parking like there. That is going to be very, very useful while driving. Then we are going to get landmark based directions, which will use real world information and street view imagery. Then we will have proactive traffic alerts. Users are notified of upcoming traffic disruptions, accidents or road closures. Then we are going to get easier incident reporting. Drivers can report traffic incidents and hazards using natural language phrases. Integration with other applications. Gemini can connect with other Google services like Calendar to perform tasks with user permission and we already have lens in maps for exploration which will get enhanced users can use google lens within the maps application to ask questions about places of interest now this is going to be a big upgrade to the google maps keep an eye on that i will keep you guys posted once this feature arrives lastly google has released an update to the quick share application for windows which includes a new design feature improvements and optimizations this new version unifies the sharing experience allowing you to to easily send files between your Windows PC and Android devices. The Windows app is receiving a new redesigned interface and recently the updates have introduced features like direct transfer via QR code, a higher upload limit for QR codes, now it is 10 GB per file per day and increase the maximum number of files for QR code generation up to 1000 which was made possible through the recent updates. And apparently, Google may be developing an account-based quick share solution that would enable cross compatibility with iPhones and Mac OS. If that happens, it is going to be really great. These are some new Google updates that I wanted to share with you guys. Let me know what are your thoughts. Drop a comment. While you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to download the wallpaper application Wallverse. The link is in the description. The lifetime membership is available at 50% discount now. Go ahead and check out the Wallverse application. And yeah, do not forget to hit the like button for this video. Let's reach at least a thousand likes. Thanks a lot for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.